Wade came to the U.S. for the holidays, she knew it might be the last time she saw her birth country for a while. It's not safe there to come back. Wade is from Kyiv, the capital of Ukraine. She and her three siblings were adopted by a family in Louisville when she was 17 years old. Now she's 22 and can't go back to Ukraine. She's been living with her adopted family since Christmas. We're her family, we're here, but we know that like Ukraine is her home, it's their home, it's where they grew up, and obviously we want them to be able to go back to the same place that they grew up if that's where they want to, it's where they're from. But once the invasion began, returning wasn't an option. They say that they're trying to protect themselves in our lands. They, are they protecting themselves in our lands? Our people dying. Wade's friends in Ukraine started posting videos and messages of the attacks on social media. My friends scare, are scared very much. So they hear explosions, shootings. They hide in, in, the base, in their basements and they still hear the explosion and it's so bad. And even in the basements, the walls are shaking. Can you imagine how scared they are? As she watches the horrific images of buildings destroyed and people hurt and tragically killed, she's overwhelmed with the feeling of helplessness. I can't even sleep. When I'm falling asleep, I feel bad because my friend's like in danger zone now and I'm just here safe. As gunfire erupts and bombs are dropped on the land she left months ago. I want to go home to Ukraine, but to Ukraine without war. She still dreams of one day returning to the country that will always hold a piece of her heart. Jamie Mace, WLKY News.